So guys, for the first method, you're gonna head over to search and type in troubleshoot settings. Click on it. And then once you're on this, you wanna click on other troubleshooters. Now you wanna find Windows Update. Click on Run. Wait for this to load. If it detects anything, it will try to fix it for you. If that's still not working for the second method, you wanna head over to search again and type in services. Click on it. And then once you're on this, you wanna click on any service one time and then click on W on your keyboard. Now you wanna scroll down till we find Windows Update. Here it is, you wanna double click on this. Make sure that you have the startup type on automatic and then click on start, which will then make the service status running and then click on okay. Now you wanna right click on Windows Update and then click on restart. It's now gonna restart the service. See if that works for you. For the next method, you wanna head over to search and type in File Explorer. Click on it. And now once you're on this, on the left hand side, you wanna scroll down and then click on this PC. Now you wanna find the drive where you have Windows installed on. It's gonna have the Windows logo on it. Double click on it. And then click on Windows. Now we're gonna find a folder called Software Distribution. We're gonna scroll down till we find Software Distribution. Here it is, you wanna double click on this. You want to delete everything in this folder. So you wanna highlight it. Then you wanna do Shift plus Delete on your keyboard. And then click on Yes. If you get this, you wanna click on Do This For Crown Items and then continue. Wait for this to load. If it says for you the action cannot be completed, then you wanna click on Do This For Crown Items and then click on Skip. Some folders are gonna remain, which is fine. Now you just wanna restart your computer and then this should now fix your problem. 